Hello my beautiful friends, Christina here and I'm so happy to be back in a new video with you today because I'm gonna be sharing with you what I drink in a day while I'm doing a juice cleanse or a juiced feast. Some of you might know that I have a five day juice cleanse challenge coming up and I'm so excited to be hosting this group challenge. The five day juice cleanse challenge starts soon. So if you want to join us and do this as a group, do not hesitate join now there is a link in the description below that'll take you straight to the page with all the information i'm going to be hosting daily live zoom calls approximately two hours every single day to answer your questions to interact with you and to coach and guide you through this entire journey also when you join you get immediate access to your own membership portal where you get to download the recipe ebooks another ebook, some bonus content for you, daily videos that guide you every single day through the process of your juice cleanse, and so much more. You'll also find some special discounts there. And for those of you who can't make the live Zoom calls, don't worry, I record the calls and I post the replays of these calls in your membership portals for you so you don't miss a thing. This might be valuable to some of you who also want to do this challenge, but maybe you can't do it with the group, so you can always go back and do this on your own time or you can do it as many times as you want in the future. My intention has always been for us to create a community around wellness and healing together, and I can't think of a better way to do it than to have a group juice cleanse. When we change ourselves, we change the world. I love hosting this challenge every single year. I know this year is going to be amazing. I hope to have as many of you as possible join us. I know it's gonna be so much fun. I always get a ton of questions during this time between the launch of the signups and the start of the actual challenge itself because people who've never done this before want to know how, when, why, the benefits, and so much more. And so I thought I would break down a few of those details for you today because it's actually way more exciting than you think. <laughs> I first just wanna to touch on the benefits and the why for doing a juice cleanse because there are a lot of misconceptions out there. A lot of people who think that doing a juice cleanse is about starving yourself or only about detox or it's about X, Y, or Z. A lot of people think of it as unsustainable, and very restrictive. But the truth is, is that a proper juice feast can bring you health freedom. What it actually is, is a nice reset for your system. It's a reboot. It's a solid food vacation for your digestive system so that you can get proper rest and so that you can come back even stronger. The benefits of doing a juice cleanse or a juice feast are absolutely endless. A lot of people think that you do a juice cleanse when and only when you wanna lose weight, but that's actually very far from the truth. Weight loss is only one of the benefits that come from doing a proper juice feast. I like to say that the benefits of doing a proper cleanse like this include overall wellness because you experience so many different beautiful facets of holistic well-being when you do something like this. Not only do you get to experience more energy, better sleep, your skin starts to clear, you have better digestion, you really get to flush out some of that old gunk in the trunk. This journey really does transform you physically, mentally, and spiritually. I always find that every single time I do a juice feast or a juice cleanse, I learn so much about myself emotionally. I, I get so much out of it. So much emotional healing happens for me. And for me, that is priceless. That emotional healing actually for me sometimes outweighs the physical benefits that I experience just because it is so powerful for me. Many of you know me as fully raw Christina, right? And we always talk about how raw foods bring up raw emotions because we're not constantly numbing ourselves or shoving down processed foods that keeps us from feeling things. We're constantly in a state of being open and allowing these beautiful foods to heal us. Well, juice cleansing or juice feasting takes that to the next level because you're basically giving yourself no padding there. You're basically cracking yourself wide open and allowing your body and your mind to heal. 
I also believe that because you're consuming so many vibrant colors and you're consuming so much life, you are infusing life into your body, it really levels you up on a spiritual level as well. If you're looking for connection, not just with others, but with yourself, this is a great way to tap back into who you are, your direction, your purpose, your well-being. There's just so many benefits to doing this. Consider this a very strong commitment to yourself and your health. There are a lot of wrong ways to do a juice cleanse, but I'm hoping that I can shine a more positive light on a great and positive way to do a proper juice feast. Many of you have a lot of technical questions about the how and how much I drink on a juice cleanse and all of those specific details, the, the coaching tips and the guides and the specifics, all of that is in my five day juice cleanse challenge program. That link is below for you to download the eBooks and the recipes and check those out. Those are there for you. What I really want to touch on today and essentially the purpose of this video is to talk about calories and quantity on a juice cleanse because that's why you're all here. Oftentimes, if you go to one of your local juice shops, they'll put together a little six pack cleanse for you in 16 ounce bottles and they'll say, hey, drink this in a day for your juice cleanse. Some of you might have seen that, right? Well, if you actually do a calorie breakdown of those cleanses, it comes out to be anywhere from 600 to 800 calories a day. That is extremely low. What I teach is a little different. You'll notice I have a wide array of juices and colors on this table right here in front of me. And when I do a juice cleanse, I do approximately six to eight 32 ounce jars in a day. So let me go ahead and just spell that out for you real quick. I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine is an extra backup in case something goes wrong with one of these. I typically consume around the same amount of calories on a juice cleanse as I would if I were consuming the food itself. For instance, each one of these calories ranges from approximately 300 to 400 calories per 32 ounce jar. So if you're doing the math here for eight jars, that'll give me at least 2,100 calories in my day. I average 2,400 calories in my day typically when I'm consuming raw food and when I'm not on a juice feast. But the benefit of doing a juice feast here is extraordinary. Allow me to explain why. Each one of these 32 ounce jars has anywhere from four to 10 pounds of fruits and vegetables juiced to get this amount of juice. That is a huge amount of vitamins and minerals that you are infusing into your body to get these nutrients. If you think about that for a second, that means that somebody who normally wouldn't be able to consume a salad or to be able to consume enough greens in their day can now drink a full jar of juice and can infuse their body with all of those nutrients. Imagine if you were really sick and you couldn't consume food. This is an amazing way to give your colon a break and to be able to absorb these nutrients and get so much benefit out of them. When you look at a juice cleanse with that fresh perspective, hopefully you can see that this kind of a feast, a true feast can be extremely healing for your body. It can be transformative. And you begin to see that when you consume enough juice, enough calories, enough abundance during a feast or a cleanse, that it's not about deprivation. It's about healing in so many different forms. Not only are you getting the necessary calories that you need, but you're getting, like I said, an infusion of vitamins, minerals, phytonutrients, so many good biophotons. <laughs> Uh, in these juices in your body. I had a question or a comment from somebody just a day ago uh, asking about depriving yourself with juicing. And it only becomes a form of deprivation if you're actually starving yourself while doing it. So I recommend a minimum, minimum of four 32 ounce jars a day to ensure that you are getting enough during your days of a juice cleanse or a juice feast. Now I'm barely scratching the surface here in regards to the hows of properly doing this. When to drink your fruit juices, when to drink your green juices, how to make your juices, the recipes. So many of you ask me about my juicing recipes. 
Um, I have my app that has more than 450 recipes in my app. Tons of those are juice recipes. More specifically, for those of you who are joining this juice cleanse challenge, you receive a whole ebook with enough juice recipes to carry you through five days of juicing with three different recipes each day. That's a lot of juice recipes and they are so good. You'll have combinations of everything from different green juices, some that are savory, some that are sweet. You have uh, sweet types of watermelon juices with beets and strawberries and grapes and carrots and apples and pineapples with turmeric. There's so many different delicious combinations you can make to make this a truly enjoyable experience. Your taste buds will explode. So I wanna give you all just a quick visual of how much I actually consume in one day of a juice cleanse or a juice feast. So in front of me here, I have eight jars of juice and I typically have a ninth one as a backup for the end of the day, just in case I want extra. During my days, I'm super active. I still work out, I'm still burning calories and I wanna make sure that my body's properly fueled because I believe in health freedom and not deprivation. If this looks like a lot of juice, it is because I'm used to consuming about 2,400 calories a day. So for me, this fills my carbohydrate fuel tank. Let's say I'm not as active in a certain day as I am on others, then I might knock off two juices and I might do six jars of juice in that day. I really listen to my body. I make sure to have a variety of sweet juices and non-sweet juices and I always make sure that I'm drinking as many colors as possible from as many different fruits and vegetables as possible. Like I said, I am barely scratching the surface here in terms of the proper way to execute a cleanse so that you're successful on it and so that you feel good. So for those of you who are really wanting to join this challenge, I highly recommend it because every single day that I host one of these Zoom calls, I spend about two hours with you live every single day, talking you through this, answering questions, guiding people through this. It's so much information, I cannot fit it in this video for you, but hopefully you get an idea of what I'm talking about because it is life changing. So let's talk for a quick second about juicers. So many of you are asking me what juicer I am using for this juice cleanse and what juicer can handle juicing copious amounts of juice all at once. I am using a Nama juicer for this challenge. It's the one I have in my kitchen. It's the one I love. It can easily juice all of these juices in an hour, hour and a half for me in the mornings with no problem. Uh, it doesn't get backed up. I don't have to clean it twice. It's just so seamless and fun and easy. I crank up the music and I just juice. So for those of you who are really interested in doing a juice cleanse the right way, invest in your health, invest in yourself, invest in getting a proper juicer that can handle doing this sort of a thing. When you go to a department store and you buy a really cheap juicer, they tend to break easily and you just won't get the results that you want. I've done several comparison videos with the Nama testing quality, quantity, time, efficiency, and more, and this juicer is one hands down every time. For those of you who are interested in getting a Nama juicer, there's a link in the description below, and I'll also include a discount code on the screen for you so you can get a special discount off this juicer. I also think it's important and worth mentioning that there are a lot of third-party websites out there that say that they're selling this juicer at a discounted price, but they're actually all scams. There are no third-party websites that sell the Nama Juicer, only the Nama website sells the Nama Juicer. I can't tell you how many people have messaged me thinking that they got this juicer 50% off and then the scam websites either took their money or they sent them a really bad knockoff version. So please do me a favor and if you're going to get a Nama, use my verified link. You can use the discount code on the screen. Please don't buy from those other third-party websites. They are a scam. There's so much to learn when it comes to eating plant-based, going raw vegan, going vegan, or even just learning how to juice more fruits and vegetables. I hope this video today gave you a little taste of what's to come. We have barely scratched the surface. The five day juice cleanse challenge starts soon and I hope to have you join us. If you're interested in giving this a try, whether going full on out and doing the full cleanse or even just trying one juice a day with us as a group, please join this challenge. It's gonna be so much fun. 
The links are below for you and as soon as you sign up, you'll get immediate access to the membership portal with the eBooks, the videos, the links and times to the Zoom calls and so much more. All the links that you need are in the description below for you, so be sure to check them out. I wanna thank you all so much for sharing in this passion of wellness with me. It means so much. If you've liked this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button because there is only more to come. I hope to see many of you participate in the upcoming Juice Cleanse Challenge, and I hope to see many of you in my next video as well. Sending you all my hugs and my love. I'll see you soon. Bye.